And I think I'm going to need to have to come out of the game and come back in again because I'm losing blockage. And that's not so good. Yeah, right, okay. I'm going to come out of the game and come back in again. Back in a moment. That's better. It's working now. Hello, piggy dude. I think that horrible, horrible noise is blaze rods. Blaze blazes. Now, where did I come through? There. Yeah. Not happy about this. I'm not in my comfort zone. Another dead end. I'd better find nether wart in here. I really had. Okay. Torchy torchy, yeah. Torchy torchy. Torchy torchy. Ooh, nice dodge. Nice death. Hang on. No, that's where I came from. So I came down here and turned that way. Right, okay. Aha! I find the... I find the... The nether wart, I think. Yeah. Let's just gather me up some soul sand as well to grow it on. Because you must have soul sand to grow your nether wart. What don't we need? We don't need the nether fence. We don't need the nether rack. We don't need we do need the soul sand, okay. That's it. Okay. We're doing alright. Our checklist of things we need to get is being ticked off nicely this will help with our alchemy because everything seems to originate from nether wart I think that's what we've got yeah it seems to be a base for absolutely everything in alchemy so and that requires that we have found this fabulous place surreal lighting there's a balcony to nowhere this does just get shoehorned in doesn't it pit of lava for no apparent reason okay don't want to wander too far from my path which I think was around here. Yep, with my weak-ass feeble torch. So we'll push on down here and see what else we can find. Uh, thusly. More nether wart. I think we're going to have an issue with memory again shortly. Yes, we are. I think I'll be back in a moment. Okay, so that's another little hiccup avoided there. Let's just get this lot sorted. And then I think once we've gathered these warts and soul sands, We've got the blaze rod we came for, we've got glow dust we came for, we've got soul sand and nether wart we came for, so we'll just get the heck out. Before something bad happens, we push our luck too far and we end up toasted. I don't need to take on any blades, blaze spawners. 
How many blaze rods have I got? I've got three blaze rods. That's enough to make an alchemy stand. I've got a theoretically limitless supply of nether wart. So we should be doing oakily doakily. So if we just follow our torches back where we came from. We get a bow and arrow ready because we could have to do some fighting. Judging by the noises coming from this place. Hello, piggy. So here's my torch where I came in. No immediately obvious ghasts. Nothing looking terribly threatening there. Apart from him. I think he's the product of the spawner. But I'm not sticking around to find out, people. This is me running away now. When I get back into my own little world on my own happy little island and shut the damn thing down. Because too much excitement is not good for you. Keep an eye out for ghasts. Because at this point in time, that would not be a welcome sight. Nor would plummeting down here like that. Exactly what I wanted to avoid. So this is where I didn't torch. This is the section I didn't light up. But up here should be a torch. So that's a bonus. Still no sign of the gas that's making that horrible noise. Just got to find my torch path. There's one. And there's some more in distance down there. Excellent. We're on the right track, people. We are heading back to where we're comfortable. With wheat and stuff. None of this bizarre underworld antics. Just keep following the torches for years. And don't scorch your furry ears, furry ears. There's a torch down there. Ah, this looks like something I did. Next torch. Anyone? Anyone care to tell me where the next torch is? I'm thinking that... Is that it? That's it. It's over there. Yep, here we are. I thought that one was going to be difficult. Right, so my trail of torches leads me exactly to a nether fortress. Gold, there's another ghast about. This is where we took one on last time. He sounds like he's right on top of me. I'm panicking now, people. I'm getting rubbish frame rate. I don't know where the next torch is. Ah, there we go. Where is that ghast? That's where we came back over. So theoretically down here should be our little stone hidey hole. I think this is maybe where I was doing battle with a ghast. I don't know for sure. No, it doesn't look terribly convincing for that, does it? I need to be down there. So why have I got two torches here? Ah, that's why I've got two torches here. No, we're not home yet, people. Sorry, I've been deceiving you. Ah, there we are. There's our little idyll. Our gateway to heaven. Excuse me, piggy man. I'm going in here. And 
kill the frame rate and we're home and we're killing if we can diggy dig 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 go oh, it's nice to be back in daylight there we go killed it did I pick that up ooh that's not okay so we're back on our little island and I have turned off the nasty thing we had a bit of a crash there I'm hoping now that I'm out of the nether the memory leak issues will be going away because I could live without them so we have supplies that's what you say on no can't say that that would be wrong 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 okay cobblestone back in your little box you served me well there cobblestone you might as well have the nether wart nether rack nether rack nether rack plenty of nether rack nether brick don't know why I got nether brick got nether wart gravel stone soul sand soul sand ah oh, there it is excellent happy days happy days indeed we'll hang on to the arrows so we can do some shooting and I think we'll put our glowstone in here let me just check I can't remember how to make glow bricks is it four? yes it is okay so we can make probably a stack roughly 